good day! Our lesson for today is about draft site development plan and also how to manually plot the lot. This lesson is designed to introduce you to the techniques and processes of plotting the site development plan guided by the National Building Code Standards. The site development plan is the outline and measurements of the proposed building and its placement on the property. This shows the position and the location of the building with property line, setbacks, approaches, grade contours, landscapes, and other pertinent data in relation to the site. A site development plan is drawn using a scale not smaller than 1 is to 200 meters so that the other features found in the plan will not be greatly affected. The following are the terminologies used in discussing matters about site development plan. The first one, site. It refers to the area of land available for construction or the lot on which a building is constructed. The building site may be a single lot, a series of lots, or a subdivision. Number two, lot. Lot is a piece of ground of specific size. Property lines are those lines showing the exact area of the acquired lot. Setback. It refers to the distance at how far a building can be built within the property lines. Planning and designing. A master plan is defined as a visual presentation of conceptual ideas supported by mathematical calculations aimed at giving convenience and comfort to the users or occupants. Plot plotting. It is the process of drawing the exact shape, square, rectangle, trapezoid, and measurement of a particular lot from the technical descriptions shown in the title. The boundaries and lot orientation on the north, east, west, and south are also attained. Lot plotting involves the use of lot bearings. Lot bearings are horizontal arc or angle measured from a north reference line in a clockwise direction to a point of interest some distance away from the point of measurement. Example, N 30 degrees west, read as 30 degrees north due west. N 76 degrees 56 minutes west. Read as 76 degrees, 56 minutes north, due west. S, 34 degrees, 14 minutes, 16 seconds, west. It reads as 34 degrees, 14 minutes, 16 seconds, south, due west. In order to draw the exact shape of a lot, we have here a table showing the technical descriptions of a lot or title. Below is the step-by-step -step procedure on how to manually plot lot points using the example table. Step number one, designate the north reference line. As a rule, north is always to be pointed vertical up with respect to the paper. Copy the example technical descriptions of the lot title, the points, bearing, and distance. Step number two, place the center point of the protractor on a known point and mark the desired bearing. Rotate the protractor so that it is aligned with the north reference line. The first bearing, 61 degrees, 54 minutes, north, due west. Find the 61 degrees on the protractor as shown in the video. Extend the bearing line the distance using a ruler. 
you can use the scale 1 is to 200, so the measurement or the distance will be reduced in its size. By 1 is to 200 scale, you just simply divide all the measurements distance into 2. Step number 4, plot the second point, 24 degrees, 8 minutes north due east. Follow the step 1 to 3. Find the 24 degrees on the protractor as shown in the video. Use the distance of points 2 to 3 and use the scale of 1 to 200 so the measurement will reduce its size. Step 5. Plot the next point 68 degrees 3 minutes south due east with a distance of 11. Again, in your protractor, find the 68 degrees. Step number 6, connect point 4 to point 1. Step number 7, Finalize your drawing by using the appropriate line type to indicate the property lines. Label each property line using the given bearing magnitude as illustrated. 